Welcome to the video tutorial of GreenCloud VPS. It's common for Windows to show an error when you're performing simple tasks. When deleting files, it will display you require permission from the system to make changes to this folder. This error means you're not the authorized user to make any changes to the chosen file or folder. Usually, the cause behind it may be that the folder owner is another user or in case the above error is caused by a virus, you lose your admin rights or at least temporarily. In this video, we will show you how to fix this error. First, open the Run dialog box. Type CMD and press the Control, Shift, and Enter keys to open the command prompt. Enter the following command. This command will delete the folder that you have not been able to delete yet. You can also force delete a folder from the PowerShell command line interface. It is pretty similar to using command prompt. Now, open the run dialog box. Type PowerShell and press the control, shift, and enter keys to open PowerShell with admin access. Next, enter the following command. The recurse parameter deletes a folder without prompt confirmation, and the force parameter will forcefully delete the folder. In case this error is caused by a virus, you lose your administrator rights or at least temporarily. You can re-grant the folder permissions. Make sure you are logged in with the administrator account. Right-click on the folder and select Properties. Select the Security tab. Click on Edit and click Add. In the text field, enter your currently logged in account username and click on Check Names. If the username entered is valid, it will automatically change to your device name and username. Click OK. Next, make sure the Allow option is selected for the full control. Click Apply and OK. Now, you can delete the folder normally. 